Hello, my name is Krishna Bayu Pradana from 3D, Basa English for Communication and Professional. Today, I will explain about terms used in export and importing goods, which is in the module of 15 chapter, chapter 15. First one is the Convention on International Trade in Endangered Species of Wild and Wild Fauna and Flora, which is SITES, is international agreement that protects species in danger and guaranteed that international trade does not harm the existence of species in the wild. Next one is a shipper letter of instruction, SLI is a document of approval that exporter give its a representative or freight forwarders. The document provide guidelines on how to handle and store the shipment safely, safely and without damaging the goods. Next one is beware, B3 waste or hazardous and toxic materials is a left offers from a business or activity that contains or uh, toxic materials that materials depending on their nature, concentration and quantity may directly harm the environment, raise human health and threaten the existence of other living things. Next one is free trade agreement. It's a pact between two or more nations to reduce barriers to import and export among them. Under a free trade policy, goods and services can be bought and sold across international borders with little or no government tariff, quotes, subsidies, or prohibition to inhibit their exchange. Next is import tariff, are paid by the authority on goods both intonation. The amount that will be set on important goods is typically determined by their value. Next one is import declaration. It's document that includes information about 2.5% income tax, 10% value at tax, and various import duty at different level depending on the AS code. Next one is a presen presidential decree is official command or instruction given by president of nation. It's a type of executive action that has legal force, allowing the president to make choice and carry out policy without recurring provision from or approval from the legislative branch. Next one is Harmonized system is under the a numerical method of classifying trade product. It used by custom authority around the world to identify product when assessing duty and tax for gathering statistics. The next one is export declaration is a document that contains information should as exporter recipient custom broker if available, means of transport, country of destination, and the goods like type, quantity, container number, and relevant documents. The last one is the term custom area. It refers to a place inside a custom station or any location where, <laughs> where export or import are typically stored being cleared by the custom authority. Next is the use the terms in sentence. First one, SITES, besides protecting endangered species, also foster international collaboration in wildlife conservation efforts. Next is in addition to shipping, a shipper letter of instruction can be used in the logistic industry to provide with dents on handling and storing goods during warehouse operation. B3 waste management is essential to ensure the safe disposal of hazardous 
material generated by industrial process, minimizing their impact on the environment and human health. Free trade agreements not only promote growth, economic growth, but also encourage culture exchange and cooperation between nations. Next one is import tariff play a crucial crucial role in balancing domestic and foreign trade, ensuring fair competition and protecting local industry. Import declaration is necessary for customs to appropriately assess tax and duties on important goods, contributing to efficient revenue collection. Residential decree can be used to address urgent matters swiftly implement policies, enhancing the ability of governance. Next is the harmonized system. Simplify international trade by providing a standard Z product classification framework, facilitating smooth custom procedures and accurate data analysis. Next one is export declaration enable custom authority to monitor and regulate the flow of goods living country ensuring compliance with trade regulation in the custom area in the context to international airports can be bustling hope where passengers and their belongings undergo security and custom clearance products procedures before entering or leaving a country. I think that's all about terms used in ex uh, 15, uh, chapter 15, exporting and importing goods. My name is Krishna Bhaya Pradana. Thank you for watching.